Tyron Liu is a successful NBA head coach. He led the Cleveland Cavaliers to an NBA championship in 2016 and has spent the following three seasons as the Los Angeles Clippers head coach. Lou was a player before becoming an NBA head coach. And Lou began his NBA playing career with the Los Angeles Lakers, where he spent his first three seasons in the league. Lou appeared on the All the Smoke podcast with Matt Barnes and Steven Jackson recently and recalled a wild party anecdote from his Lakers days. Coming from Mexico, Missouri, and then Nebraska, what was that L.A. just lifestyle, palm trees, sand, women? How, how, did, how, how did you guys take that in? Man, me and Doodles um, hit the ground with 21. So me and Doodles first get here. And so um, who took us up under the wing was Eddie Jones. Oh, gee. So Eddie Jones took us up under his wing. He knew how to move. Yeah. yeah. And we went out 27 nights in a row. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Matt, 27 <laughs> nights in, did we do this? <laughs> Two, doing 27, it. 27, <laughs> 27 nights in a row, Stack, for real. And like, man, that, and that right there, just that just changed who I was as a person. You know, but like, I never, monkey, never, drink, yeah, never drank, yeah, never drank, never smoked, you right. know what I'm saying? But like, just, in there. just opened your eyes to a lot of different things, yeah, man. It, it was, it was crazy. And so, you know, a lot of people can't play in LA. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Because it opens your eyes to a whole nother, whole nother lifestyle. <laughs> and it's just different, you know what I'm saying? So, but I had great vets that, that kept me straight. B. Shaw, Robert Ory, Horace Grant, Rick Fox, you know, D. Fish and Shaq. They took me like, nah, we ain't, you're not doing this. They took me under the wing and got me straight, what I'm supposed to do. And that's kind of like what I think was missing in the game today. Yeah, the veterans, the, the time, vets are bro. gone, man. Because you know? even if they're not playing, yeah, they it's can keep the locker in room check. presence, yes. off the court, traveling, it's huge. keeping you out of shit, taking you out 27 straight nights. Bro, it's just bro, shit bro. you don't get. You don't want to do that, bro. You trust me, you don't want to do that. Okay. You know what I'm saying? To give them that game. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, right. 27 straight nights in the summer. It was summertime, yeah. though. It wasn't during the season. Some people do during yeah, the yeah. season. <laughs> but, but I'm we just did. saying, like, <laughs> the, <laughs> we did. The, the, vets are, yeah, the vets are missing, man. Like, yeah. two games. Just be able to teach, you know, just different things man and so you know yeah. the young teaching the young so hopefully yeah. we can get together real. tyron lu 46 played for seven different nba franchises across his 11 year playing career but he spent the most time with the atlanta hawks lu averaged 11.0 points 3.6 assists 1.8 rebounds 0.5 steals 1.4 turnovers and 2.0 personal fouls per game across 189 total regular season games played with the hawks franchise 76 starts lou shot the ball with great accuracy from behind the three-point arc during his time with the hawks he converted 39.4 percent of his threes as a hawk lou may have never been a star player or anything close to it but he still carved out a productive nba playing career and won two championships playing alongside shaquille o'neal and kobe bryant on the los angeles lakers 